Hey guys, the Mega here. By now you know about Tippy and the Raspberry Pi case for it. There's two versions, the Raspberry Pi 2 and 3, which the lights will show up, and then the Raspberry Pi 3 only, which you see on the screen now with the light pipes in the front. Now the unit comes in three separate pieces. The, the front, the case, and then of course the stand, which you see here. Okay, so let's uh, take a look at how to take it apart. On the back, you'll have four little screws, and it comes with its own little Allen wrench, so you won't have any problems. Uh, just don't lose the Allen wrench later. Okay, the thing's got vents everywhere, so for, for great cooling, it's got the vents on the front, vents on the top, and on the back side of the case, it has vents too. Now, this thing is really nice looking. I mean, it, look at the back of the way it's built. I mean, the, the metal for the screws, you know, the, this thing's not going to wear out over time if you, for some reason, open up your tippy case all the time for something. So that's a thumbs up for me. And there's two little screws you see in the back. Don't forget to take those out before you try putting your uh, Raspberry Pi in there. Otherwise, you'll never get the case uh, to shut. And what we're showing on the Raspberry Pi 2-3 case right now is the, the, the holes on the side for the lights and then the SD card. And of course, the back top is where the, uh, the wires come out to go to the tippy unit itself. These things are printed on four of these monster 3D printers. Uh, I mean, these are nice printers. Okay, so this is what it looks like uh, in real life, hooked up to my system. And let's get a little closer look here. And I think that looks pretty good. Anyway, hope you like the video.